An alleged victim of brutality suing three Bridgeport police officers after a YouTube video surfaced showing some uh, questionable behavior. The NAACP as well as the man's family are speaking out about this. News 8's Allie Reed has their reaction. This video shot by an anonymous witness shows an alleged suspect being tased, kicked and stomped on by Bridgeport police officers. The incident happened more than a year and a half ago, but just a few weeks ago, the video was uploaded to YouTube. The man being kicked is Orlando Lopez, who at the time was 25 years old. His mother saw the video for the first time this weekend. She shared her thoughts with us through an interpreter. After seeing it so many times, her conclusion this morning was, imagine if they would have killed my son for kicking him so many times. One wrong kick probably would have killed him. It's pretty outrageous. Um, there's a guy lying down. He's obviously uh, disabled at the moment. He's motionless during at least the portions that I saw where he was being kicked. This morning, he filed a lawsuit against the three police officers seen kicking Orlando Lopez in the video. Would commit conduct like this. I mean, they're entitled to pursue someone in the course of an arrest. They're entitled to use reasonable force. Um, I question whether anyone would consider this a reasonable force. Until now, Orlando had never filed a claim against the officers for what took place that day. The video is what changed that. Um, he was embarrassed. He was scared. And he didn't think anyone would believe him because essentially it would be his word against the police officers. When Bridgeport's police chief saw the video, he ordered an internal investigation and he pulled those three police officers off the streets and placed them on desk duty where they're still receiving their paychecks. But members of the NAACP here in Bridgeport are now inside of the police department meeting with the police chief, asking him to fire those officers. To get rid of these police officers immediately. We want. We want them to get rid of them swiftly and decisively. Both the city's mayor and Orlando Lopez's mother say they're thankful the incident was captured on camera. I saw the video. Uh, it's disturbing. She says that um, she says if there was no video, she feels the Bridgeport Police Department would continue to abuse young kids, minorities, and um, she has other children, and she feels that you know she doesn't want it to, to happen to her children or anybody else's children. In Bridgeport, Allie Reed, News 8.